What is going on, Sagittarius? This is Jen catching you on BTWJ Life. Hope you're having a great day. Shooting for my laptop because I'm not going to bother fixing my desktop until I'm ready to. Um, it's being kind of a pain in the butt, but I'll get it together. It's all good. Not a big deal. It's cool. So we are entering Leo season, and that's what this reading is based off of, uh, which is lasting from July 22nd until August 22nd shuffling your cards. Um, <clears throat> I put up on my fan page, um, asking, you know, what everybody wants me to cover. So it's anything between finance, business, uh, anything legal and, uh, personal relationships. After the first shuffle, this is what I'm getting. Peace and justice, but no creative, uh, beginnings. So we'll find out what's happening with that. Um, I have a feeling this has to do with something legal or perhaps a legality that ties in with business and or employment, which obviously touches your finances, right? So let's see what's going on. I always go with what's in the deck. I always go with the cards and also, you know, spirits leading me. Yeah, I have a feeling this might touch on uh, legality. Most readers uh, refuse to <laughs> cover legality, um, but I don't mind doing it because I've been in business for myself for 10 years now. Um, so I'm used to de uh, dealing with uh, legality uh, pertaining to my business, um, you know, also in general. So it's not necessarily a bad thing. I don't know why people are so scared of it. All right. Okay. Ooh. All right. All right. So far, it's looking good. Um, but we're still uh -huh, in the midst of finding out what is happening, Captain. What is going on with all of you beautiful Saggies, my archers? <laughs> Ooh, I like that. Oh, you guys are always on top of your stuff, man. It's beautiful. I love it. It's amazing. Okay. All right, then. In your conclusion, one of your clarifying cards, and I'm going to go ahead and spoil it, is new beginnings, new opportunities, and options. So... I could see why lightning inverted had come up um, because of the fact that it's clarifying the um, <clears throat> conclusion, which we'll get to. Don't worry. <laughs> Just saying it always comes out in cards. It's real. Um, all right. And you're present. You're establishing great one. You absolutely freaking are. You're in the midst of establishing, continuously establishing. You're never finished doing that. Um, you might be, uh, creating new accounts, right, for your business, going out, uh, talking with people, marketing, perhaps canvassing, that sort of thing. You're establishing something great right now. Um, you're in tune with uh, your infinite energy, your inner child, which provides that. You're aware of everything that's going on in the present. Clarifying that. We're looking at victory and ambition, non-stop ambition, like I said. It has to do with going out, uh, creating new accounts where there were accounts lost or inactive accounts. And this is going to bring forward a sense of um, affluence. That's what this card represents, is affluence. Coming in ninefold, which is everything coming in full circle, recognizing your self-worth on a psychological and logical level. Beautiful thing. Love that. In your near future, dude, I'm telling you, you guys have got it together. In your near future, which could um, enter its uh, itself in <clears throat> August or September, either one. Ozone upright. Everything within your network 
is going to make sense. All the people who are in your network are going to be nothing but healthy for you. It's coming. Beautiful thing. This has to do with the set of sustenance you've always known, i.e. your business. Everything that you've been running for how long now? Very good. Keep, keep up the good work. Keep it going. Avalanche coming in, in tandem with affluence. That's what's going to come in. You're going to see a lot of financial gain, a lot of material gain coming out of this. Um, perhaps a little bit of ma uh, material gain and more financial gain. Pay attention to the material gain more than you do the financial gain. You already know how to, to do accounting. Don't worry about it. Pay closer attention to the material gains that you have. And I'm going to tell you why in a minute. Coming up, in your conclusion, healthy desires inverted. Fire within fire, north node. There's something that is not moving forward with a healthy desire that you have. Um, perhaps you're putting it on the back burner. You shouldn't. But don't worry. It'll make itself very evident to you. <laughs> Volcano upright. It will make itself very evident to you. It will blow up. Not your face, but it will blow up. All right. What, what is um, the thing that is supposed to be coming through, that healthy desire that's supposed to be coming through will after the volcano erupts, bringing it forward to your attention, which is going to release more options, new opportunities. And the new opportunities, I believe, have to do with uh, new clients, new accounts that you're going to be seeking and opening. Beautiful thing, guys. Um, if you want a reading uh, pertaining to a different subject, or you want more guidance on this subject, check out the information in the description of this video, and uh, book a private reading with me, okay, guys? Blessed be. Good luck to you. Keep rocking. You guys are doing great. Take care.